Hello, I hope all is well. So, doing treasure trails has long been one of my favorite RuneScape pastimes, and waiting until I have 50 caskets before opening them all it was kind of challenging, but here I am, I have 50 hard clue caskets ready to open. Now, I've done this before, but, and I'll link that video in the description, I had over 100 last time, but those were from buying 100, ca or 100 mil worth of impling jars. These are entirely received from Slayer, so it took me a while to accumulate these all, so I'm gonna go ahead and go through them. That's a nice 359k. Those teleport scrolls really are worth an awful lot now. So what I'm doing is I'm hoping for master clues, obviously. Um, my account is nowhere near max, but I am able to do almost all of the master steps, so hopefully I won't have to uh, drop any of those. But um, but yeah, so that is the goal. Hopefully, uh, based on drop rate, I should be able to get like three, maybe four master clues. Hopefully I'll be able to do them all and maybe get some third age. I'm not looking so good so far and getting a bunch of junk like... 40, 50, 100k, uh, pretty disappointing from hard clues. I think last time I did this, when I did like 110 of them uh, from impling jars, I think I only averaged like 130k per hard clue scroll, which was pretty disappointing. But hoping for a little bit better uh, this time. I remember back in the day when you do a hard clue and you could get like a piece of Zamorak armor, it was like 500k back when 500k was a ton of money. Uh, so that's still just junk so far. Those are good, those blessings, though. Good for God Wars, at least. 50k, absolutely nothing. Nothing. Oh, there's Master First, Master Clue. All right, so that took me 20 uh, to get my first Master Clue. I always hate these ones that take me into multi in Deep Wilderness, uh, but I feel like the Wilderness is pretty dead lately. I did get attacked on one, uh, but it was just a single PK, and I got away pretty easily. Uh, looks like my serpentine helmet ran out of charges, so that's no good. All right, I was able to complete that master clue, uh, so back to open and hards, hoping for another one. Uh, those cavaliers used to be worth a lot of money, but uh, I guess not anymore. Uh, what is that? Okay, I'm not really sure what that is. Oh, wow, that was fast. All right, another master clue. It only took me five more casket opens, so let me go ahead and see if I can do that one. Yes, yes, I can. Ooh, that's good. Two Armadol pieces, that is a really nice clue right there. That's like the best hard clue I've had in a long time. Um, not counting the Masters, of course, because that is the goal. Ooh, those are cool. Red Dehyde Chaps. Oh, Zamorak Plate Body. God, I remember when that was near a mill. Like 2006, maybe. I spent my entire bank on full Guthix way back in the day. It was like, I don't know, one and a half mil, maybe. Junk, junk. God, those purple sweets are worth a ton. That's pretty nice, I guess. I feel like if anywhere I get, anytime I get around like 200k from one of these, I'm pretty happy. Like 200k is kind of like the, the cutoff for, I guess, what I consider a good clue. Ooh, that's nice. Armadol body. Oh, that's another pair of Armadol chaps. That's awesome. That is over 500k. Very nice. Um, all right. Okay, ooh, that's pretty good. Oh, Zamorak chaps. So I'm, I'm getting lucky with the chaps so far. I already feel like I'm doing a lot better on these hard clues than last time I did that. God, purple sweets must be worth so much. Oh, another master clue. I think that is the third one. All right, now I may get a little bit of flack for this, but I am not, I don't have Song of the Elves done. That's one of the few quests I don't have, and I'm not going to get it done right now. My personal life situation doesn't isn't really conducive to sitting down and focusing on a Grandmaster quest for five hours, so I am going to drop that one. Um, oh, wow, two more, and I got another Master Clue. So I actually went back and picked up that other one because I had one or two steps done on it. And I was actually going to try to juggle it. Uh, I learned this from watching Swampletics, that you could actually juggle clues and get credit for the steps done on both of them. This is super convenient. The guy asked me for Barrow's gloves. I was already wearing Barrow's gloves. So I did end up trying to juggle this a little bit, but I wasn't able to because I needed to complete a lap of the Relica rooftop course, and I did not have full graceful. I needed to get like 10 more marks of grace. So I was not able to uh, keep that one clue, but I did get the, the second one done uh, the next day. There is one more master clue. Uh, one more, I was able to get that one done as well. And just gonna go ahead and open the last two caskets here. Uh, nothing else special. 
All right, so there is 50 hard caskets opened. I do have four master caskets. Gonna go ahead and open them there. Got five total, was able to do four of them. That is a bit of a letdown. Um, that's not too good. 700, okay, that's decent. I don't see where the value is in that though. Is it the Onyx bolts maybe? Must be. I guess it's 700 and some K. Oh, yikes. Okay, that's, that's disappointing. Um, and wow, that's bad. Okay, so these masters, some of these masters were really tedious to do. Like uh, the steps where you have to find three different pieces of the clue and also some of the other steps uh, where you have to do the uh, the locator orb, those are terrible. Uh, but just looking at the collection log, now the collection log came out in 2018. I did get a third age helm uh, prior to that and also on the medium log. Uh, I did get, I have got two pairs of ranger boots that are not on the collection log uh, because they predate it. But overall, uh, I was able to get 8.5 mil or 170k per clue on the hard clues and 1.5 mil or 375k each on the masters for a total of 10 mil from this. Now, considering this is just a byproduct of doing Slayer anyway, uh, that's pretty decent and I had fun doing it. So. Thank you for watching this video. I do hope you found it interesting, and I will see you next time.